When a massive star explodes, it leaves behind a dense spinning core made entirely of neutrons, a neutron star. Many neutron stars have strong magnetic fields, and as they spin, they produce radio emission. As the radio beams pass over the Earth, we see them appearing to switch on and off, like a lighthouse. We call this a pulsar. The Murchison Widefield Array is a low-frequency radio telescope that we're using to explore the sky. We recently discovered a new source repeating much more slowly than a normal pulsar. We think that this could be a magnetar, a special kind of pulsar powered by the rearrangement of twisted magnetic fields. Alternatively, it could be an unusual white dwarf. These are left behind when less massive stars, like our own sun, reach the end of their lives. And of course, it could be something that we haven't even thought of yet. In the future, we're hoping to find more and follow them up with powerful telescopes, which could be the key to unlocking this new cosmic mystery.